So today on FCT Two Minute Reviews, we are going to go over the uh, Ryobi Five Inch Random Orbital Sander. And the sander with the battery weighs two pounds and zero eight point eight ounces. And so when it comes to this sander, I I use this a lot throughout the years and. It always did me justice. You know, it's only $44, so it was well worth the purchase. But recently, I've been actually working on some furniture with my friend. It's, and we actually compared this to the Makita sander because after uh, a certain amount of rotations, this would actually sort of like uh, tip itself over. Yeah, this orbital sander really isn't too great when it comes to the very high grit sandpaper. You know, the final sand through. As you can see here, we're actually using sand netting. And so this did have issues when it comes to keeping the surface clean from uh, swirls and uh, designs from the orbital feature. All right, so we did compare this to the Makita, a versus video will be coming in the future. But this sander is good for, uh, for good bulk work. It lasted a long time. Just kept on swapping batteries out uh, one after another we, when we ran this for, a, for hours. And yeah, but uh, it is actually a pretty darn good product, but when it comes to the very fine-tuned stuff, you would actually need a much smoother and uh, you would need a much smoother sander. Last thing I want to say, I honestly think it's not the it's not the motor or it's not the the fact that it's Ryobi. We just think that this sander is a bit too tall and it sort of messes with the gyro as it's as this is rotating. Uh, the the we think that the height of it sort of messes up and it sort of and it sort of does like like and it sort of does like that once in a while. It actually is a pretty good sander for the price and it does a lot of work that uh, the, your average contractor would need. But when it comes to furniture building, you, you do need a sander that's a little bit more fine tuned. So that's pretty much it on this MCT two minute review. I'll see you guys in the next one.